Well, I guess we're back to the iPhone because uh, try trying to do an interview, right? Trying to do an interview. I, I mean, I, it went, went okay. It went well, but no, that's wrong. But the thing is just not. It's it's just not video. It's just not video material. Um, yeah, it, it keeps wanting to turn itself off. It keeps wanting to do weird shit. So, I mean, when I when I do the when I get the first escrow check from, I'm gonna put some of this stuff back in my backpack. When I get my first escrow check from for the uh, the real estate deals that I'm doing, um, they're gonna be they're gonna be slim deals to begin with. But I'm definitely fuck it. Mm. You know, I mean, I know it's a cheap phone. I know it's a cheap phone, but it's like, come on. It's like, come on. I mean, this is ridiculous. This is absolutely fucking ridiculous that it wants to turn off like that. Um, she did. Uh, yeah. She and, uh, I think, I guess, it might have been her dad or something. They, um, because, yeah, I don't know. It, they made some good points, but, I don't know, I, I'm, just, I'm really bummed about the camera not working. Because it's like, I don't know, it, mm, fucking irritating. Um... Because it's like, I want to be able to, like, turn a camera on. I mean, the, the little, the little Nissan, uh, Nissan camera that I have, uh, that, that one didn't turn off or anything. You can zoom with it, all that stuff. Maybe that's what I need to start using. But I need to figure out, I just need to mess with it somewhere. Um, because I've messed with the iPhone. The iPhone is pretty reliable. I mean... I mean, this, this iPhone has been, this iPhone has been dropped, it's been, it's been, you know, a lot of, it's an old phone, you know, an iPhone 5, it's an old phone, I was so happy when I got this phone, and it's still reliable, it's still durable, it still does what I need it to do, the volume works perfectly, everything works perfectly on it, never had a problem with it, never never had a problem the stupid you know stupid phone that I use for this big one for the watching YouTube videos I can't hear people when they fucking call me on it I try I can't hear people um, I had to buy a new charger for it because the charger was acting it was just it's not a good phone and it kept fucking turning off, and it kept it. Oh, the nightmare, fucking nightmare. Um. So yeah, when I get when I get a good sized escrow check, escrow check after I, after I get the dentures. Um. Because they're cheaper than. See, and I can I can do this and I can do that, and, you know. I can do all kinds of shit with the with the iPhone. And it'll just do its job. Meanwhile, that stupid ZTE phone. Good God. When, when you have to coddle a phone, when you have to treat a phone like it's a fragile, delicate piece of equipment, there's a problem. I mean, I know phones are made cheap to begin with, but... There's really no excuse for that level of that level of cheapness with a phone. Some people brought their mother homes. Uh, I don't know. Part of me wants to almost fucking go get something to eat and then wait till some stuff opens up. But I don't know. I need to go home and do more real estate stuff. Um, it's been pretty enjoyable. 
Yeah, the phone just cannot keep up. Yeah, it just can't. There's just there's just no no point. Um, the iPhone, this phone. Yeah, I think the next one I'm gonna get is probably they're gonna be uh, Samsung Galaxy latest model, probably, or another iPhone latest model. Because they're not that expensive. I mean, if you've got like if you've got like 800 bucks, you can get one. Yet I know for some people it's a lot of money, and for me it is a lot of money. But you're trying to do business. I mean, this phone, the iPhone, I can do so much business on it, and it's reliable. Oh my gosh. I mean, it's like there's been times where I've, um, you know, gotten gotten uh, contacts from sellers. I've gotten contacts from sellers. People wanting to either sell me their house or talk about selling it. And, uh, you know, they leave me a message on this TV phone. And I have to just be simply... Um, I have to basically just call them on the iPhone because there's no other, there's no way that I can hear them. Some people, they call me and it's like, it sounds like they're off in the distance. So I got to pull out the iPhone. Got to friggin' call them on the iPhone. Oh, it's a pain in the butt. I even had a couple of people call me today. Um, but I just had to let it go to message because you know, I'm out here doing the parade thing and uh which it is enjoyable it is fun I wonder if the, I'm not even that's a pretty motorhome right there I don't know if the screen if the screen were bigger it's just it's a pain in the butt that that seat it's just a pain in the butt that's all it is. This thing's much better. So yeah, uh, uh, I know seven minutes of bitching about my fucking phone. It's frustrating. It's very frustrating. So la 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 la. Aren't you afraid that they know where you live? No, I don't care. Um, yeah, I... Dental implants aren't going to be that much either. Dental implants... Uh, I think that's five thousand dollars for top and bottom, so it's actually pretty affordable. What I need to do is I need to find one around here that can do it, because I'm not gonna, I'm obviously not gonna go all the way back to LA for dental appointments. It takes me like two hours to get to. It takes me two hours to get to certain parts of LA. And the valley that I need to go to. Guess how guess how long it would take me guess how long it takes me to get to Long Beach on public transportation. About two hours, but that's taken the train. It's taken uh, you know, the different subways and stuff. Anyway, I'm just gonna walk back to my home. Right out. <sighs> so I will cut it off now and uh, talk to.